some people contacted me concerned about eating raw eggs. Well, I boil my eggs for about 60 seconds, which uh, will help neutralize the uh, avidin, which will bind with your biotin of vitamin D, um, and only during that meal. I think, however, the main reason people are concerned is uh, salmonella, and that's mainly caused by chicken feces on the outside of the shell. So boiling the eggs will get rid of that. Uh, but um, if you're concerned, you can soft boil these for about four minutes and then throw them in a uh, bowl or whatever of icy water and then um, just crack them open and uh, scoop them out. Now they're harder to scoop out because uh, you know they're more well done but um, if you're concerned about the rawness of the egg um, then do that this does denature the protein a little bit more but that's up to you and um, the other difference is that it is kind of nice because um, I've tried this uh, to see how it would taste in the shake and in the smoothie and it actually gives it a more thick consistency. So it's really not bad. So I'll just demonstrate what I do. By the way, as a tip, I bent an old spoon that we had. This is for putting the eggs in the boiling pot of water and pulling them out. I'll pull them out of the boiling pot of water and one by one I'll put them in this uh, ice bath. That's just if I do the four minute egg. If I do a 60 second egg, I don't do all this. I don't use the ice bath or anything. There's no need to. I do the ice bath because these things will, steep, will keep cooking. So we're just going to crack one open. <clears throat> and they don't really crack open. But they're going to have a soft... Um, oh, okay, this one's a little better. I didn't go quite four minutes with this one. With this batch. Uh, but here's the yolk. And this yolk, I eat three yolks and give three to my boxers. So I always have two spoons. I'll put the half egg on that spoon while I'm scooping out the, the egg white out of the other one. And that's pretty much the process. I'll do one more. So I myself, if I have two smoothies a day, I'll end up eating 12 eggs. That would be six yolks and uh, 12 whites. But here I am scooping it, uh, separating the yolk from the egg. I've got a dog bowl over on the counter. I'm gonna put that there. If you don't have a spoon or something to put the other shell in, it just tips over and spills all over the place. And that is it. And then you'll add this to the smoothie. Um, but again, this is not an exact demonstration because when you cook the four minute egg, I probably went two to three minutes on these. Uh, there's really hardly gonna be any gooey yolk. It's all gonna come out like a soft boiled egg. So it's a lot, little harder to scoop out, but you will see that I am uh, having to scoop out the egg whites because they're partially cooked. And here's the last of them. So I will add this to my uh, smoothie. They're more cooked than I usually do. Cooked eggs is full babies. But um, even more cooked, you can do this, uh, which I've done a couple times just to see how it would be. And so the consistency is almost like, uh, uh, like hard-boiled, between hard and soft-boiled eggs, and there's no liquid here and then you can throw those in your smoothie it actually gives your smoothie i think a little more thick consistency all right the end